so here's the Tao Tao motor with the first big bore kit and this is the pair system that I'll be removing and it runs through this hose you know back here to a filter and then down to the vacuum line so you have to plug up this vacuum line too on the intake but that's just for emissions we don't need that and it's gonna be dark soon but I think I'm gonna go for it and try to do it tonight so again I don't really make how-to videos but Here's the pair system, and this is what I'm going to be removing. So it's just hooked on here with your like rubber clips, kind of. It's convenient, my panel's broken off, so I can just move it like that. But yeah, you just got to get this little rubber piece off. And there it goes. It was already broken, the vacuum line to my intake, so no worry there. But we'll plug that vacuum line right here. We'll just leave this on there for now so we know to plug it. And this end just goes to open air. This is a little filter. Probably another little type of filter in that canister maybe. And it goes through here, connects to here, up through the silver thing to there. We're not going to have this anymore. So once you remove the screws on the valve cover here, you can take the hose for the pair system off. Just use some pliers. And this is kind of how to remove the pair system from here. So then you just remove these three screws and that'll remove all of this silver part here. But once you take those off, you can remove that silver piece. And then this is how your valve cover sits. You just pop that off. And there's a little reed assembly in here. Let me see, right here. You should be able to just pop that out. Bottom like this, you know. Pull that off. This little reed assembly was inside, you pop that out. And this hole doesn't matter because it doesn't go into your valve cover. You can see here, it's just that indent. If you didn't have the valve, the non-ERG valve head, you would need to make a blocking plate for here. But, and then what you're left with for the other side is the hoses. It went like this, and this one went to that silver piece. And the silver piece went through the reed valve up into here, and we don't need that. So. That's one little project you could do. You can delete the ERG system. If you're gonna make a blocking plate for right there, the GT Vert showed a good way to make one out of this. You just cut this off and then put a little bit of weld in here. And then you can use this piece as your blocking plate.